Hi guys, welcome back to GFFA Games and our continuing playthrough, the Deathwing campaign of 1993's Space Hulk. Um, I have had to put a little pause in the video <laughs> between uh, these missions. I couldn't play through the whole thing because I've reached a mission called Antechamber. That is incredibly difficult. Anyway, let's continue and see if we can get through it. Mission code name Antechamber. Now let's have a look in the manual and see what extra information it gives us. Under your command, the first squad in this accursed hulk must establish a beachhead. Fight your way to the control room. Flaming the correct area will shut off any mechanisms controlling access points to lower levels. This is a vital mission. The fate of the campaign and Captain Lithonius is in your hands. Our sensors have detected flammable material in the corridor approaching the target. Do not use the heavy flamer until in the control room. To do otherwise will risk the lives of your squad members. Now we've got a very tiny map on this uh, mission, but it is just incredibly difficult. You'll see why in a moment. So, mission code name, antechamber. We have left behind the charred remains of the planet's surface. The Space Hulk, Sin of Damnation, has emerged from warp space. Traces of Captain Lithonius emanate from deep within. Our initial assault must our initial assault must establish the extent of enemy possession. Brothers, our resources must be used wisely. Now for your detailed mission briefing. Listen carefully. One squad is available for your command. Deploy your squad here. Let the purifying flame cleanse this area. Move at least five Terminators to this area. The evil approaches from these points. Life forms have been detected. Hesitate and you will be lost. Your squad has been carefully selected. Alright guys, uh, before we jump into this I will just say I'm not probably going to be commentating very much during this mission because I've played it so many times and I expect I'm going to need to play it so many times more that there really isn't much that I can say so um, uh, just excuse the silence On your guard. Overwatch. 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 Die. They came... Beware! Ready! I have them! On your guard! They escape! Beware! Jam! They flee! Die!
Ready! To the Emperor! On your guard. Tempestium. Overwatch. Death. To the Emperor! Jam. We bring death. Overwatch. I think we've done it. Your mission was a glorious victory. Thank Christ, Jesus. That must have been 30 attempts at that mission alone. <laughs> I've nearly gave up on this game, I'll be perfectly honest with you. Oh, that was... That was frustrating to the point of not being a challenge, it was just not fun, you know? It probably looked quite easy based on uh, that, but that was after many, many attempts of... <laughs> well, getting the tactics down, I think. Jesus, that was tough. 
See what's next. Mission code name The Perimeter. The previous missions served as a reminder that the Gene Stealers are more than just a menace, they are a worthy opponent. The sheer number of the evil that were encountered have led us to abandon that area as an entry point. The Hulk has been scanned and another possible area found. Secure strategic points and establish an assault perimeter for your fellow brothers to enter by. Be on your guard for the Gene Stealers know of our presence. Go forth and let your weapons preach terror to the Hell's foe. Okay. Our initial assault location proved to be too infested with foe. Establish a new assault perimeter. Look to your brothers for support. Now for your detailed mission briefing. Brothers, one squad is available for your command. Deploy your squad here. Hold these points. The evil approaches from these points. Life forms have been detected. The fire of anger burns within us. Your squad has been carefully selected. Have faith. On your guard. Overwatch. Overwatch. Let none live. We bring death. Overwatch. 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 Jam. This one's mine. On your guard. Jam! Okay. To be very careful we here. Bring death. Overwatch. Oh, thank God. Have succeeded. Oh, sorry for the lack of the uh, commentary again. Uh, it was just these missions are going to take a very lot of a very 
long time for me to do <laughs> because I'm doing so many attempts. Obviously you're only seeing the successful ones which makes them look quite easy but um, it's not and um, you know I, I just can't comment the same thing the same things over and over again so um, yeah the vast majority of these I think are gonna receive very little commentary as the games are actually being played so the missions are being played which is fine I think um, let's see what's next Okay, mission codename Funeral Pyre. This sublevel of the Hulk is being used to house Gene Stealers to house the Gene Stealers brood. Four specific targets have been identified. Unfortunately, the walls of this level are emitting some flammable gas into the passages. Any heavy flamer hit will continue to burn. If used correctly, this phenomenon could aid you in the mission. If a heavy flamer shot is used without thought, your whole squad may become trapped. Exercise caution at all times. Only through your commands can the squad succeed. Plan carefully. May the might of the Emperor go with you. Okay, Funeral Pyre. Move with great caution through this sector. All indications are that the enemy are here in strength. They will endeavour to block our progress. Use overwhelming aggression. Now for your detailed mission briefing. Brothers, one squad is available for your command. Deploy your squad here. Purify these regions. Exit via the teleport area here. The enemy will come from these zones. Bless your weapons and go. Go to the armory and select your weapons wisely. Okay, this is the first time we have been able to do this. So these are our squad sergeants, I believe. Great bear. Weapons to be chosen. Lame bear. Lame bear is one of the commanders from the short story Deathwing so it does tie into this uh, it's probably worth reading before you play this game I'm not sure what this skull means here <laughs> I think it's meant to be something to do with um, experience but we've died so many times in this campaign I don't think we've got any experience whatsoever You can see some of them have got squads already assigned to them, um, and I'm assuming these are uh, their specialties. See, this seems like a good one to take because we knew we need three heavy flamers, and that seems fine. Okay. Now we can change up any weapons if we want to. These are the tech priests. This screen doesn't look quite right to me. I think it's going far too fast. <laughs> Might want to put the power sword on our... As you can see... Let's try that again. It's meant to bring up another screen, but I think we're just going so quickly that it's uh, not quite working right. But never mind. I might try and uh, slow the game down uh, at some point in DOSBox. On your guard. Okay. Stormbolt is in position. Flamer here. Take out the first target and block those spawners. 
a second flamer to take out the second target and block those spawners. And the third flamer just move up. Okay, so we're coming from down that way. You can move up there. You come up here, turn that way, and take out those spawners. You are going to do the same when you can. You can just come up behind to take charge of this guy and. Uh, out that uh, gene stealer. Let's freeze time a second. Now we're going to get Storm Bolter to move up here. You are coming in support. Flamer here. Flamer here. And then a flamer behind who's going to turn around and uh, help block off. On your guard. Overwatch. Right. So this flamer is in position just to burn that area. All we're doing there is just, as you can see, some of these guys have been able to run through fire. So hopefully they won't be able to get through that fire as well. <laughs> I don't know if it's possible, but uh, we'll see. So we're going to want our second storm bolter to move up to here. And then you are going to turn around and come up to this place as much as possible. And just burn there when you can get to the top. On we are going to take charge of this guy and just push forwards. Pause a second. What else have we got coming? We've got a guy coming that way. I'm not sure if we'll get to the top in time, but let's try. Pause. Tempestium. So you've got Gene Steel that's spawning directly on top of us. Overwatch. Burnt him into position, that's fine. Let's get our other flamers moving up. There. Got another guy coming that way. Hmm, okay. So our final two targets are down here, which we need to get to first. What we could do is just blocking off some of these positions as well if we can. So if we have this flamer follow us down here. You can come to here. Turn that way and flame up there. Then turn. Okay, maybe you can't turn all the way around, but. Uh... We'll see if we can block those off at the same time. The problem is, I think. Tempestium. Where the um, targets are is going to be.
pause a second. You get down here. You. Okay, you're going to have to go with him. And you are just going to cancel your action. Oh, don't walk backwards for God's sake. Turn around and do the same thing. I don't want you both going down there. You come back. But don't walk backwards to come back, <laughs> if you know what I mean. They escape. Right, he's flamed that, so then you're going to turn around and flame down there you are gonna Ready. take that guy out so the last section we need to take well the last spawners blocking our exit at least are um, these two so if we can get a guy here to flame both of those, we should be in a pretty good position to take that to the final two targets before getting out of here. Just need to check. On your guard. Yeah. That means I've only got two shots left, I think. I'm not quite sure. Okay. Let's take you. You're going to come here. Turn that way and fire down there. You're going to turn around. Take charge of this guy. Let's see if we can do this. I do need to also be mindful of... On your guard! What have I just done? Don't do that. Keep an eye on the map for where the other gene stealers are spawning from. Overwatch. He's done that. Also flame down there. Right. Perfect. So that should be... Let's get him to come here. Then you can come back to support us down here. Ready. They know fear. We are just gonna try and push forward a little bit. Death. Just pause for a second. Make sure our flamers are coming up as well. You have decided to move backwards because we didn't tell you not to. That's something you've got to be careful with for this one is... Uh, they just do exactly what you tell them to. Tempestium. I have them. Right. Again, Mr. Flame has decided to uh, walk backwards, so you. Ideally, we want to go here and fire down there. You're still walking backwards. Why? Turn around and then come down here. This flamer, we want to come here and fire at that target. Have faith. Where are they coming? 
coming from. Not coming from anywhere at the moment. Let's get you down here then. Overwatch. Okay, that's that taken care of. The only last... I think there's a spawner down here as well. Right, so number two. You might as well turn around and start heading down here. Number five, you as well might as well head in here. Number one, you're just going to take a step backwards. Then number four is going to come round here, turn that way, and send some purifying, f purifying flame down there. Let's Overwatch. see if we can do this. Okay, then you may as well begin to head backwards as well. Fortunately, there isn't enough room in the teleporter for all of us, but uh, number one, just going to bring him back there then. Just hope that none of these gene stealers break through the. Uh, fires we've got holding them back. Overwatch. Watch. It's like one G steel has broken through. Your mission was a complete success. There we go. Okay, there we have it. So we managed to... Every Terminator survived that one, but unfortunately only three were able to uh, teleport out of there. I'll be honest, the last time I played that mission, I survived. I think I only had three Terminators surviving at the end, but the game crashed for some reason afterwards and didn't save my progress. So... I'm quite happy that I was able to do it and have everybody survive, which is decent. 
Okay, the next mission. Mission code name Testament to Honor. See what the uh, manual has to say about this one. Leaving the upper levels burning, the Imperial forces push deep into the dark depths of the Hulk. Here, scanners are useless. Only the ex only the exploring movements of a squad can map out the level. Work through the area to the teleport location. The objective is simple: purge the gene stealers from this sector. Okay. Brothers, we have been drawn deep into the lair of the foe. A funeral pyre behind us and a labyrinth ahead. Battle brothers, you must fight for your lives. Fight to continue the search for our lost brothers. Fight to regain the honor of our fallen. Now for your detailed mission briefing. Brothers, the hive mind has blinded our senses. One squad will be sufficient. Deploy your squad here. Exit via the teleport area here. The evil approaches from these points. Scanners indicate that there are many life forms present. Begin the litanies of hatred. Go to the armory and select your weapons wisely. Okay, in this mission we get to choose the squad we take with us and their armor. I am going to try to slow the game down a little bit. I think it's Control F11 for DOSBox. Not sure if that's done anything. Um, it just seems to be going a bit fast when you're trying to select guys. So that is a customizable one. That's not going to be any good. We really want to take a guy that's um, lightning claws, chain fists, and thunder hammer. Heavy flamers. We do want to take a close combat kind of team in. So maybe he's the best. As you can see, it's still going ridiculously fast. Uh, is that... look at the flames. <laughs> is that going any... Uh, it's still not letting... Uh, yeah, you can still see that it's going far. Far too slow, isn't it? <laughs> I'm not sure. We might have to do this in the config file, uh, kind of sort it out. Okay, we're going to take all, um, what do they call them, uh, lightning claws, anyway, and see how we do.
Deep metal. Eat this. Deep metal. Eat this. Might be going the wrong way here. See if we can do this. Nope, 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 nope. <laughs> right, you. Step forward. Close that door. Your mission was a glorious victory. <laughs> oh my, I wouldn't quite call it that. <laughs> right, again, I'm sorry I didn't really say much during that mission, if anything actually, but that was an absolute nightmare, and that has taken me... Uh, well, two attempts today to get that done, but probably about uh, 20 attempts previously. Yeah, not the most fun mission. Okay, mission code name Descent, and this is from the missions booklet. Fight through this sector, destroying any gene stealer that crosses the path of your weapons. We are currently delving into the very core of the Sin of Damnation. This is a most important time. If the evil ones are allowed to break through, all our efforts so far might have been in vain. Our sensors have detected large objects of metallic composition. These may be blast doors. If the information is correct, then an assault cannon will be needed to gain entry. Okay. Mission code name Descent. Advance further toward the enemy. Cut through their defences on the search for our brothers. Sweep aside the foe. Descend, I assume that is, further into the Hulk. Now for your detailed mission briefing. Brothers, one squad is available for your command. Deploy your squad here. Exit via the teleport area here. The evil approaches from these points. We 
sense their dark presence. Bless your weapons. Your squad has been carefully selected. On your guard! Okay. This one... There's another tough one, it's just figuring out the best way to go about what you're doing. Let's stop that to get you up there for the time being. Tempestium! Overwatch! Okay, I wasn't expecting to not get attacked as I came into this corridor, I'll be perfectly honest. Overwatch. So now I've got a lightning clause. Overwatch. Where are you going? That way. Okay. So you're all facing resistance now. We don't want him to push up too far because um, if he even sees a hint of a gene stealer, he wastes all his ammunition. Beware! Right, so let's get you around here. We've really got to try and put our trust in these lightning claws as much as it's possible to do that. We get him there. Get you up here. Down here and turn that away. Get you here and turn that way. Let's see if that works. <laughs> Coming at us from all angles by the looks of it. Overwatch. Right, now you... Fight with honor! Deep metal. Why can't we seem to get him to, uh, to fire? Seems to have got ammunition. There we go. <laughs> See what happens here then. On your guard. This one's mine. Right, so can we now try and get this guy into the action a little bit? Get him down here. Get the lightning claw guys in first. 
if we can. On your guard. Okay. Now you've got company coming the other way. Let me jump you down here and turn you that way. Overwatch. might be best just trying to get out of here you know Okay, I think they can come in here, you know. Probably weren't paying attention. On your guard. Overwatch. Not sure this is going to work out for us. Your mission was a glorious victory. Oh, thank God. All objectives met. That's what I like to see. Okay, I'm going to call it there for the day. And um, I'll see you next week for more Space Hulk. We might finish the campaign. I'm not quite sure how much is left. But uh, we'll find out. Thank you for watching.